The off season was uh, obviously uh, a lot of uh, exciting energy. Uh, obviously, coming off the season that we had, uh, the returning players I think were anxious to uh, get back at it. Our off season was pretty tough in the winter and the spring. Uh, we had a hard uh, workouts in the weight room. We did more like CrossFit type workouts. In the winter, we've had probably the hardest training sessions I've had um, through the weight room, through John. They really ramped it up this year and it's been really tough. Spring, we kind of worked more on like tactical stuff. Uh, we got a few games in and we didn't have a lot of players, but I think we did really well and really set the tone. Summer was kind of just more of maintaining. We would get together almost um, every morning, 6 a.m., sweet woo. We pushed ourselves, we wanted to keep it maintained. We didn't want to lose what we worked so hard in the winter and so hard in the spring for. So I would say our off season has been very hard because um, to help us reach our goal of winning CAAs this year. I think last year we all saw something special on our team. We all really played for one another and I think that's really what helped us be so successful. Everyone had each other's back on and off the field and that mentality has been carried over into this year. Top of the bottom of our team, everyone is strong players and Everyone gives something new and different to the team. And with our new freshmen coming in, they seem really excited about this year, and returning players really excited. Every season is new, uh, regardless of uh, how the previous season went. Every season is new, and uh, we lost some players, uh, obviously, through graduation. But um, you know, the way you view that is that it's opportunity for new players to come in. It's going to be tough losing five seniors at the same time. They taught us so much, there was so many of them. Bringing in eight new freshmen um, is going to be tough, but I do believe that they taught us a lot last year and we're hoping to teach the underclassmen the same thing that they taught us. Well, we're still very close to the team, so I don't think we lost too much of the chemistry. I think um, we just need to pick up from where we left off and keep moving forward. The freshmen coming in seem like they're ready to get on the same page as all of us and want to win a championship. They're, um, very confident, which is usually pretty, usually takes freshmen a little bit longer to get adjusted, but they definitely have the talent to compete with us and make us better. It's a different team. It's a totally different team, so uh, it's more than just you graduated nine seniors or five starters. It's a lot more than that. So you have to accept that challenge every year, but um, it's absolutely different because there's new, there's new elements, there's new, there's new parts. You know, how will it turn out? It, that's, that's what the season's all about. Team! Our biggest strength of this team here, uh, I think, is right now their drive, their desire. They want to challenge for that championship, and so the, the drive has been there more so, I think, um, at least more evident than prior years, uh, and they have a lot of uh, experience coming from last year. So um, yeah, I, I would just think it's, it's that desire um, from doing so well it would be their biggest strength. I think our biggest strength is our confidence and mentality. Um, being that we were so successful last year, we're hoping that that mentality and focus will carry over into this year. Having the best season at Drexel and being a part of the team was like a big accomplishment. It'll be a memory that I'll always remember to be a part of that team, like making history at Drexel and trying to do the same thing this year. I think a lot of it had to do with our confidence and momentum. Uh, we knew we were always capable of being that successful, but once we started beating teams, it just kind of picked up from there and we knew we could do it and we were always an underdog, which was just kind of like little fire inside of us. I think the biggest strength on our team is definitely our defense, starting with Eve um, in the back to Chappie and Andy on the defensive line. I think our defense is what wins championships and I think that's why we got it so far last, last year's their defense. Combined, we're pretty unstoppable. <laughs> Overall, the schedule for this year, ambitious, but you know, I think our team is ready. We, we made an ambitious schedule um, because we feel that this team is prepared and able to withstand that challenge. And if you have aspirations of, of looking beyond uh, conference tournament and um, you know, possibly suggesting uh, an opportunity for NCAA tournament, you're going to have to prove that you can play against teams all around the country. So similar to last year, we went out west um, playing Hawaii. Uh, this year, uh, staying kind of a little bit closer, and we'll play Colorado College and Air Force Academy. The trip out to Colorado, I'm very excited for. I've never been to Colorado, but um, it is a business trip, as Coach says. Um, so I'm excited to go see things new, also try playing a different state. I guess the air is going to be very different. I'm really looking forward to it. I always love the trips. They're good, team bonding, um, especially going somewhere I've never been and somewhere 
where we've never played those schools, don't know anyone that goes to those schools, just a totally new environment. Um, trips are always really fun. We get some other activities in other than soccer, so I think it's big for our team to be able to do things like that. The conference schedule is what it's all about. Our goal is to be one of the top six teams and get a playoff berth, and then once the playoff starts, uh, as everyone knows, anything can happen. Yeah, when you look around our conference at CAA, it's definitely one of the strongest, stronger conferences around. Every game counts, and we just have to expect teams to come out hard against us and be ready for anything, really. Everyone sees Drexel as a pretty tough team to play. We're not someone you just look over. I think our conference is going to, are going to be out to get us. It's, we took it to them last year. The expectations for the season are very high. To win the CAAs this year, um, without a doubt, that's what I want us to do. Finishing second last year, the only way to end is going out in both ways. We know what it feels like now to be a playoff team, and we're going to expect to be the same thing this year and just use that as like a challenge for ourselves and a goal to make it that far. They want a championship. Uh, they could taste it last year, and now uh, it's definitely on their minds. Uh, it's no longer to just try to make the playoffs, it's to make up playoffs and then when you're in there to, to win a championship.